WTOC Slynn Snyder is live in Savannah where city leaders have been gearing up for the possible impact of the storm as well. Flynn, what are they saying today? Yeah, Mike Don, we are live outside of Chatham County's Emergency Operations Center where officials have been warning people about possible uh, power outages and other impacts from Idalia. And across the coastal empire today, we've seen not only emergency officials, but also shoppers getting ready. Tonight, the coastal empire and low country brace for Idalia. Shoppers at this Costco and Pooler buying essentials like water, toilet paper and batteries, including this woman visiting from Florida. We do this about four times a year and I'm not sure why there's still water in there because in Florida there is no water. We've been talking to our friends back home and they're ready. Command posts across the area have boosted staffing in preparation of any needed response. Chatham County's Emergency Operations Center now in an advanced monitoring stage and partially activated. We've got extra staff in here today doing that monitoring and also collecting situational awareness of what our partners are doing, making sure that they are aware that there is a storm headed this way, what the potential impacts for Chatham County could be. Officials don't anticipate any evacuations in our area with Idalia but say now is the time to prepare for any potential impacts expected to arrive by Wednesday. Some isolated flooding issues. Uh, there is a potential for windblown hazards and things to be knocked out of the trees and possibly some down, uh, down power lines. Back at the grocery store, shoppers expect store shelves to become increasingly empty as Idalia sets sights on southeast Georgia. So I think by tomorrow, as the storm gets closer, I think you're going to see uh, people act a little bit differently. I think that the shelves will probably be empty by tomorrow. Yeah, and Chatham County's emergency management director says the good news is that officials have had time to prepare for the storm. Idalia is not sneaking up on them. Still, the message we've heard today is to not panic, but be prepared. Get your kits ready, secure any outdoor furniture, and just have a plan. One